South Floridians coming together to show their solidarity with Israel. In Local 10's Terrell Fournier is live in Sunny Isles Beach where one of several local rallies were held. Terrell. Yeah, communities in both Broward and Miami-Dade are proving their solidarity with Israel. Here in Sunny Isles, you'll notice the American flag, the state of Florida flag, and the flag of Israel all at half staff right outside of a place where people were invited to pray together. <laughs> On the heels of one of the darkest days in Israel's history. There is no greater power than the power of unity. The Jewish community here in Sunny Isles Beach is gathering to pray. We are all family. I am the sister of every person that was murdered. Some people holding defiant signs spelling out their anger against the Hamas terrorist group and others with signs highlighting glimpses of the turmoil. We're all one and God is one and that's the main prayer of Judaism. So to come together is to know our strength and to support each other in a time of sorrow. Even the youngest faces of them all are learning about the cruel evil acts that hit so close to home. We are trying to be very open because it's a reality and it's better to talk to us in better, in, instead of like looking in the media and you know. Not easy. Not easy. In Broward, another solidarity rally for Israel. Tonight is not one of celebration. Tonight we respond to acts of Sinat Hinam, baseless hatred. Attendees at this Cooper City event Wednesday night donned support on their hats, across their backs, and on their shirts, even with large flags. But everyone here, Jewish or not, is carrying Israel in their heart. That this is an opportunity for people of all races, faiths, and creeds to come together and stand up for the human rights of the Israelis. One thing is clear tonight, the lives of so many people forever changed, including right here in South Florida. It is very likely that we will see many more of these types of uh, gatherings and prayer services and even interfaith prayer vigils in the days and weeks to come. We are live in Sunday Isles Beach tonight. Terrell Fournay, Local 10 News.